before seeing very important table, <coughs> very significant one, as you will see yourself, <coughs> about the situation in Israel, meaning the Israeli government, which is now basically Islamic Israeli, because there are some groups of Islamic, like Mansur Abbas, other. So, what you are going to see is very, very important idea behind this situation. And then we'll see so much to learn from it for our times. So let us first start with the interesting situation of the Knesset of Israel. Now what it is happening, so for example, approved yesterday by the Knesset, the new electricity law will enable connecting Bedouin homes constructed without permits to the country's power and water right. Yeah. So definitely this brought out a lot of opposition from the opposition and self-understood that as the government, Islamic Israeli government depends on Ram, on Mansur and the others, so they have to do, otherwise it will not be government. And Bennett will not be able, and Lapid will not be able to be prime minister when the time comes. So, because of this, is known. There is another thing also in the news, which uh, says the following, also for the news in fact, yeah? And uh, the news is the following about another law. The Bennett government surrendered to Mansour Abbas of the Islamic Party, Ram, and the Israeli government. The fact that the state of Israel is negotiation with law breakers and stopping the planting of Tubishvat. Yeah, we you know every Tubishvat is a custom in Israel to plant. And now they are stopping it. And uh, because they bet you and said, no, the ground is ours, the Negev is ours, don't plant there. So the planting of, of Tubishvat was stopped. <laughs> it is not only a reward for terrorism and encouraging violence, but also raising a white flag of the set towards the writers. It means that we see that whatever the Bedouin or even the Arabs also in Israel, and Israel really outside now. They cannot do many things, even they said to if they will have to fight in Gaza and so on, they will not be able to it because Mansour Abbas uh, is for the Islam, for the Arab, for the Palestinians. So now that Israel now is a very, very difficult situation. So let us see <coughs> what is Mansour Abbas, yeah, what he was before. And now also, so Amun Basar support the rights of return. Now, it is known, yeah. See, when the Mansour Abbas will be able to bring this laws, they will do it, and Israel will not be able to resist because there is no government. So we know the, the rights of return is endangering Israel. So this is why Netanyahu stopped it. So calling Israel an apartheid state, and the Israeli police, the Occupant police, this is what Abbas support said, who met with released terrorists and their families and who defined himself as Muslim, Palestinians and Israeli, in the other slavery, and Islamic, definitely. Some of Abbas' colleagues have only in recent weeks embraced Raed Salah, the head of the Islamic movements, northern faction instigator and supporter for convicted terrorism after his release from prison. They met another instigator, Shaykh Akram Sabri, head of the Supreme Muslim Council, the man who indirectly supported the suicide bombing and explained that the Muslim loves this and Shahida is the Jews love life. So the Israeli government is dependent on the votes of Mansur, it is known. So let us see some more important information about what is going on now, and then we see what our rabbis tell us about what 
is going to be. So basically, we saw about Mansour Abbas, the Islamic party, Ram, the head of it. So let us see now what 400 years ago Rab Chaim Vital said. Rab Chaim Vital is a pupil of the great Kabbalist, Isaac Luya. So he said the following. There is a book which you can see it. It is called In Hebrew, Es Chaim Rab Tov. Israel will be at the end of days in the exile of Ishmael, Islam. This is the fifth exile, which is the most difficult of all. It is the exile of Ishmael called the wild man. Amazing. So clearly indicates where we are now, yeah, under Ishmael, the exile of Ishmael. But the question is how we have a state, a government, even prime minister. But the fact that we have to surrender to them, to the Islam, is itself already shows what is written now. Now the purpose of it, why? In fact, here you can see even more clear what Abraham Bital said on Psalm 124. You already know that the exiles were only four Babylonians, Madai and Persia, Greece and Edom. But Israel will still be at the end of days in the exile of Ishmael and the fifth exile, which is the last of them all, is the most difficult of all. And it is the exile of Ishmael, who is called in the Torah, wild man. It is also written in the Zohar, Kabbalah. You have no difficult exile for Israel like the exile of Ishmael. Amazing. So all of them is written here. And also, another interesting which is written, the future redemption will be similar to the redemption of Egypt. As it is said, as when you came out of the land of Egypt, you saw the wonders. Therefore, the chances then Faith led to the exodus from Egypt. So also today, by faith in the coming of Messiah, we will come out of exile. So very important. You see that faith, belief in God, is the most important condition to come out from exile. So from where we learn <laughs> faith, what are now the government of Bennett? There's a case in the Sabbath. Sabbath is the <laughs> basis of faith. You know, so it's not faith. <laughs> And uh, definitely Lapid and the other in the government, Meres, don't believe at all. So how can we really get out of this exile? So look, amazing idea why Jews are in this situation of exile. So there is a book very famous, Rabbi Liao Dessa, Mikhtar Meliao, Style for the Truth, I think, in English. In volume three, he said the following, very long, interesting article, he said, Israel was given into the exile of Ishmael because of a defect of faith. The head that needs to be corrected in order to be freed from the exile of Ishmael, which is based on faith. Unbelievable. So the reason that we have now to be under the Islam to learn faith. Hey, look, the Islam... Yeah, as they believe in the Allah is Akbar, they believe in God, they will do everything, suicide, they will give their life for God. And you see clearly, really, what uh, Mansur Abbas wants, he wants slowly to roll over Israel as the Islam because he's a believer in the Islam. So, what you should learn how <laughs> important is faith, belief, yeah? And it is known, clearly written, that if Jews are unfortunately neglecting faith, believing in God, so their enemies are taking it, exactly what you see today. So it means what we should learn from these Islamic parties to see how strong their faith is in God, and God, the, the believing is a God, one God, <laughs> of Israel also, amazing. So it means the situation that we are today is to have problems with the Islamic party, and all those, unfortunately, connected to them, that you should learn what is important of faith, because the only merit of faith, Jews will be saved. So let us see now the table, which is unbelievable and very significant. You have here, best meeting in the Torah of Galut Ishmael, the exile of Ishmael. Now we're in Galut, the Jewish people, yeah, in Galut. Now, 
which kind of exile? Unbelievable. Islam. And one should know that the word Islam appears in this skip small only once more. It means that the statistic that Islam with exile, if Ishmael will come, they want to, <laughs> some say even cannot say, millions. Quite amazing, but clear picture that Israel now, children of Israel are now in the exile of the Islam. Unbelievable. And definitely, why? Because of faith. Because faith. Now, who are fighting against Israel now? I mean, against also Jews, the, the leftists, Maris, they are also like the uh, Islam. Not that they don't believe at all, but nevertheless, they don't accept the face of the Torah. So, what more we have here? Unbelievable, you have definitely the exile of Islam of Ishmael. And then you have Bennett, <laughs> definitely, he's a prime minister. And who very much also uh, supports it. And in fact, he said clearly that if he will be the prime minister, he will realize the Palestinian government. And he said, that we really, we should stop the planting. We should not tease them. Amazing. So all this situation is amazing. You have Mansour Abbas, you have Mansour, you have here. And we know quite well that all this is happening, is pushed by Iran. <laughs> there might be all this Hamas and uh, Jihad also are really working by Iran. So, what is important here, as we said, that only by doing shuva, I was to strengthen our faith in God, only then you will be able to be saved. And we know Joseph is an example of it. He, he is a man of fear of God. Always he said, I'm God. Fearing will not do anything without him. So, very, very interesting. And here we have, really, who are those enemies of Israel who try to put Jews, <laughs> Israel in exile? I mean, this is Amanai. Every Amanai, unbelievably. Amanai, yeah. In Iran, he is this one, the Aman of today, right? Exactly like that. So, the works with Hamas. So, unbelievable table, very, very significant. I says only the fact that you have exile, Galut, Ishmael, the exile of Ismail, with Islam together in such clothes. So it is one to many, many, maybe even millions. And what are the chances that the Islam, which is only one there, will come exactly next to the word exile? So most statistics people say that <laughs> you don't need statistics. Basically, this program that I'm using is Dr. Alexander Rottenberg, who himself became. Orthodox Jews, he's a Russian scientist, came from Russia, like Professor Ips, and Professor Ips showed me this phenomenon. I said, clearly, <laughs> it's from heaven to rise the blueprint of creation, as we know quite well. And he said also, the most important is best meetings, yeah, which he had here. So, very important, really, and significant table to understand that we are today in. Then, hoping that really, will strengthen our faith in God and realizing that everything but the, uh, uh, the pupil of uh, Isaac Lawyer said so clearly in Psalm 144, because 124 you will see is a psalm we describe the, the troubles that the Arabs will do to Jews in the future. It's amazing. This is what exactly. So now this is what we have in Israel. Now in Israel we have Islamic Israeli government. So the Islam also can decide. And unfortunately, already we saw what they decide. Yeah? <laughs> they decide that even without permitting, you can do things like those we're doing. And the other side is also the planting of Tubishvat was not allowed because it says the Negev, this is also Bedouin said. So everything, unfortunately, is now under the Islam because Israel <laughs> must listen to them because. Once they don't listen, so they will not support the government. There's no government. So, very important, significant table also shows the truth of the Torah. So, as I said, very, very significant. As the table is uh, very highly statistic, we say that uh, to have best meetings and small Islam, I mean, in the old Torah, and so definitely for this you need uh, 
very much, you know, prayer and faith. This is what can help Israel, praying to God. This. If not, who knows what will be after we had, unfortunately, 